log in to begin running rates. Click Get Rating on the top right corner of the screen. Enter in the ship date, it must be within seven days. Next, enter the shipper's zip code if it's a U.S. location, followed by the consignee city name if it's a foreign location. All foreign locations will require the city name and not the zip or postal code. Proceed by entering the commodity and the total weight per line item. Ensure you are using the correct metrics. Our system will accept pounds or kilograms and inches or centimeters. Lastly, enter the total quantity. Select any additional services, click Get Rating. Take note of the Items and Services recap, which will be found on the left-hand side of the screen. All quotations will provide a rating reference number in the form of a clickable link in which you can go back to at any time. Our system will also calculate the total value volume for you as well. As you can see, our system will provide several options, both air and ocean, displaying a breakdown of all charges, estimated time of arrival, transit time, terms and service level. For door-to-door, -door, duty and tax are collected prior to delivery from the consignee. For door-to-port, the price will not include destination terminal charges or customs entry. All quotes will provide the basic routing of the shipment, displaying the port of loading or the container yard it's going through. After all options, let's book a door-to-door -door ocean option with the transit time of 43 days. This is the booking screen. When manually inputting the shipper or consignee address, simply click on the box and start filling in the name and contact information as requested. A name and phone number are very important in order for our operations team to contact the parties within a timely manner. The email is used as a contact. We'll be receiving daily tracking alerts as well as notifications if we are missing paperwork. We have a very strict no docs, no load policy. When finished entering all required information, click Save. You can also choose the shipper consignee information from the drop-down of saved addresses if you shipped to that location in the past. In the Special Instructions box, enter in your broker information if you are not using X-Rates Broker, or enter in any other information you feel may be useful for our operations team. A Schedule B number or HS code is required for all shipments. You can search for a similar commodity in the Autocomplete search box. However, if you cannot find the correct description of your commodity, do not attempt to use an incorrect one. If you cannot find your item, our system will not let you proceed without entering the red outlined information shown on the screen. You can enter in nine zeros and get back to the operations team with the HS code when you receive it. Proceed by entering the commodity, total value, if known at the time, quantity, and total weight. Click Confirm and Book. Read and agree to the terms and conditions. And book the shipment. This is the shipment screen. The top left screen will recap the shipper consignee, the type of shipment, and the BOL number. Next is the status bar. Each bar would be colored when it's in that status. It will display signs such as delayed, missing docks, on time, or late, and which would be beyond the anticipated delivery date of that specific leg. Below the status bar is the shipper and consignee address boxes. To the right, you will see the public tracking link. You can go ahead and copy this link and share with anyone. No charges or carriers will be shown in the tracking link. Below is the document section in which you can view, upload, or download all required documents associated with this shipment. It's important that X Freight's BOL is used for all pickups. Below the documents will be the legs of the shipment. Simply click on the box to display the carrier information and location for that specific leg. Below the legs will be the tracking notes. All shipments are tracked daily by our operations team. All notes will be within this one screen, regardless for which leg. The tracking notes are then followed by the ledger, which will reveal a breakdown and grand total of all approved charges in relation to this shipment. Lastly, the final shipping specs are recapped at the bottom of the screen.
To view this shipment for future use, simply copy the bill of lading number, go to your shipments tab, paste the bill of lading number and hit enter. As you can see, the status shows missing documents and it shows that it was just booked by us today. If you do not have your bill of lading number, there are several other ways to search for your shipment. You can use the filters that our system provides, which breaks it down by mode of transportation or by open, archived, or canceled shipment. You can also enter in the shipper and consignee information to provide search results. You are now ready to quote, book, and track ocean shipments. Click the full container tab to run a full container rate. Enter in the ship date, it must be within seven days. Next, enter in the shipper's zip code if it's a US location. If it's a foreign location, enter in the city name. Proceed by entering the commodity and the total weight and type of container. If the weight exceeds 37,000 pounds, please email SpotQuotes to manually quote the shipment for you. If you are using the correct metrics, ensure it is in pounds or kilograms. Next, select between a 20, 40, or 40 high cube container. Feel free to add additional containers if needed. Click Get Rating. Click Details to view a breakdown of all charges. Notice on the left-hand side of the screen, you will see an Items and Services recap. You will see the rating reference number, which is a clickable link, as well as the total volume of the shipment. The rating will also show you the basic routing, the ports of loading or container yards that are being used for this shipment. Let's go back to step one and quote an import. Use the city name since it's a foreign country. Use this postal code or zip code since it's a US location. Click get rating. For imports, we currently only offer port to door service. For exports, we currently offer door-to-port service. For pickup or destination charges, please contact SpotQuotes at xfreight.com.